Good morning, hot dogs. Happy Columbus Day. PSAT, tutoring, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All sophomores and some juniors will be taking the PSAT this Wednesday. This test will begin promptly at 730. You will report directly to your testing location. Please check your email regarding any important information regarding the test. Club sponsors and students. St. Matthew's Preschool needs students volunteer to help with their Pixel of fundraiser on November 6th from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. Students can sign up in the main office with Mrs. Debris. Now to weather and sports. Good morning, hot dogs. We hope you have a good weekend. The high for today is 82 degrees and the low is 58 degrees. It's better rain later tonight, starting around 5 p.m. and ending tomorrow morning. That's all for weather. Now to Colin with sports. Thanks, Asusena. The boys' cross-country team had a great performance to finish fourth place overall and qualified for regionals. The team was led by, the, by two top ten finishers, Josue Bautista Ventura in sixth place and Angel Perez in eighth place. The boys' team will be joined by Benton Central at the Harrison Regional. The girls' cross-country team ran tough at the Harrison sectional, but finished one place short of qualifying for regionals in sixth place. However, Karina Alanis finished third place overall, and Alexis Reed Gill finished 21st place to qualify for regionals as the first and fourth individual runners. Full results for both boys and girls meets can be found in the chatter below. Now let's send it to Nelson with football. The Hot Dogs lost the heartbreaker on senior night to North Montgomery last Friday, 12 to 22. The Dogs started off fast with a defensive touchdown on the second play of the game and some great drives offensively. Unfortunately. They were unable to hang on the halftime lead and slow down Northmont's physical and rushing attacks. Northmont's ball control in the second half, combined with some key injuries for the Dogs, proved to be too much. The Dogs played incredibly hard with great attitude and effort for the entire game. Offensive showed great improvement this week, and defense created several turnovers. The kicking team by the special unit, uh, but special teams unit was really solid all night, even though it was not the result we wanted. We are especially proud and thankful of the senior class. Austin Bell, Samuel Morales, Yahir Matias, Sam Michael, Riley Goodnight, Vladimir Carreras, David Mendoza, Britton Wood, Bryce McDonald, Lane Todd, Ethan Cook, Charlie Garcia, and Kyle Zickman, and all they have done over the past four years. The football team travels to Crawfordsville to close out the regular season on Friday. The JV will play at home on Saturday. This is Nelson. Now back to Cohen. Thanks, Nelson. The volleyball team went 2-1 at the Twin Lakes invite, falling to Benton Central and then turning around to beat Rensselaer and Twin Lakes. That's all for sports. Now, back to your host. After school tutoring is today, Tuesday, and Thursday. Sign up using the link in your email and show up to the cafeteria after school for a snack and find out where to go for help. Lastly, Duck Cookies are taking pre-orders until Wednesday before fall break. They'll be on sale for $5 for 12 cookies, 6 M&M, and 6 chocolate chip. You can order cookies in Mrs. Bishop's room, 133, but you must have the $5 in hand. A happy birthday goes out to Gabriela Aquino, Fabian Garcia Regalado, Alan Hernandez, and Francisco Lozano. That's all for the announcements. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to get more notifications.